Excuse me, man. Is that your wallet? I think they might have fallen. What? Did my wallet fall out of my bag? I I have no idea, but I mean, if you need help finding cards or anything like that, if anything fell out, I can help you out. You just let me know. I think you should get that, because um, what what is what does four T to five T mean? Bro, I don't know, bro. Trish has been yelling at me all day, bro. I'm tired, man. What what is four T to? Okay, sixty count though. That seems pretty good deal. How much is that? Sixty count. Thirty dollars. Thirty. So expensive. So expensive. I don't know how I'm ever gonna afford this baby, man. I don't know, bro. Honestly, I'm gonna tell her that maybe we don't have it. I think you need to buy those diapers. Dude, but if I get this, like. Yeah. I mean, she's for sure gonna keep. Anybody walking down the aisle? No, why? What's going on? Well, I only had forty-five dollars in my purse, and then all of a sudden, I found like all this money. Oh, that's crazy! <laughs> Wait, you only had forty-five dollars, man. That's way more than forty-five. I know, but I didn't bring this. You didn't bring that to Walmart? Then how did it end up in your wallet? I don't know, like when when it fell out of my purse, did you see anybody like walking by? Mm, no. no. It's just me no. and him and I mean what are you gonna do with the money? You found that. Are you gonna keep it? I can't keep this. It's not mine. What do you mean you can't keep it? I mean you found it. It's not like you're stealing. like I'm stealing if it's not mine though like we're not supposed to steal I know you're not supposed to steal but like you found the money and I mean you have a kid how old is he he's about to be eight months I'm about to be eight months so I, I know he's growing um I know kids are constantly growing I mean you found that money man that's a lot of money couldn't you use that for diapers wipes and like all this stuff that you have to do? I don't have any kids I can use Not it yet. for a lot of things. I mean, my my husband just lost his job and I'm still on maternity leave. So things are a little tight and we have family helping us out, but it would really help. I just, I wouldn't feel right taking somebody else's money. I mean, uh, so what are you gonna do with that? You know, I think I'm gonna bring it to the front and see if anybody dropped money. Do you want to bring that to the security guards up front? You realize they're just going to say they've dropped it and pocketed it themselves. You never know. Maybe maybe they won't. I mean, are you serious right now? You, you, you're not going to keep it. Why well, are you such a good person? No. Um, you know, I go to church. I'm a godly woman and we're taught not to steal and to treat others the way we want to be treated so if I drop some money I wouldn't want somebody else pocketing it I mean I get that I wouldn't want someone pocketing my money either but have you lost money in like the laundry <laughs> okay and did you get that money returned to you I did I found it in my pants okay and um, so you never drop money though out in public so I think I've lost my wallet like once or twice. Okay, and did you ever get that money that was in there returned to you? Unfortunately, I didn't. That's why I would want to return it so somebody else doesn't have to feel the way that I felt. So you really care about how other people feel and you want to do the right thing? Yeah, I mean, that's always the way to go. I'd feel really bad if I left here with somebody else's money. Okay, well, look, you're a better person than a lot of people that we've tested today. Um, this has all just been a test. I have your money right here. I took this money out of your wallet and swapped it with this because we wanted to see if you would tell the truth. A lot of people would have lied and said that that money was theirs. A lot of people did try to lie and say that that money was theirs. But here, let me give you this back. <laughs> and I don't actually need that. That's for you for being the first honest person that we've met today. 
Are you serious? Um, yes, dead serious, ma'am. That is for you. Thank you so much for being honest. We need more people like you in this world. God.